Hello and welcome to the tutorial on Find the Missing Number. In this tutorial, we will learn how to find the missing number with numbers up to 1000. And we're going to be looking at addition questions. So let's have a look at our first example. We have something plus 627 equals 900. And 43. Okay, we've used quite a few different methods. For this one, we're going to use simply the add on method. Okay, we're starting at number 627. We're going to be adding numbers to this until we get to 943. Okay, we're going to start with the units. We've got seven units. How many units do we need to get to? We need to get to three units. Now, if we're adding a number to 7, which is the next number which has got 3 units, and that's 13. So 7 plus what number is going to give us 13? 7 plus something equals 13. The answer is 6. 7 plus 6 equals 13. Okay, We can now add these together. 7 plus 6 is 13. Carry 1 over. 2 plus 1 is 3. And lastly, we have the hundreds, which doesn't change just yet. Okay, notice how the three units over here matches the three units over here. On to the tens. We've got three tens. We need to get to four tens. So what number do we need to add to three to give us four? Well, that's simple. We need one. Okay, the tens, the units doesn't change. Now we can add these together. We have 643. Now notice how the tens of 4 and 4 matches. Okay, We are now on to the hundreds. We've got 6 hundreds over here. We need to get to 9 hundreds. What number added to 6 is going to give us 9? The answer is 3. The tens and the units don't change. Now let's add these together. We've got 943. That was a final check. Have a look at this number. Let's go all the way around. Do, are they the same? Yes, they are the same. So we've done it. Now all we need to do is we need to simply collate the 6, 10, and the 300. Okay, we've got, let me just write it over here so it's a bit clearer. We've got 6, the 10, and 300. Okay, we're not even adding. We're just simply collating the digits. The answer is 316. So 316 plus 627 equals 943. Okay, now I've shown all the workings. As I've mentioned before, I've shown all the workings. Over a period of time, I want you to go through the workings but then do these in your head. Now, how would you do these in your head? Well, let's have a look at our second example. We have 738 plus something equals 981. So 738 plus something equals 981. Now, using the same method, how many units have we got? Well, we've got 8 units. We need to get to 1. What number added to 8 is going to give us not 1 but 11? The answer is 3. 8 plus 3 is 11. Now, because 8 plus 3 is 11 and we've got an, a 10 there, I'm going to cross the 3 out. The 3 has now become 4. How many 10s have we got? We've got 4 10s. How many do we need to get to? We need to get to 8. 4 plus 4 equals 8. On to the hundreds, we've got 7, we need to get to 9, the answer is 2. And there we go. No workings out, 738 plus 243 equals 981. I want you to develop speed on this. Accuracy and speed. Okay, let's scroll back up again. Just to summarize, that is how we find the missing number for numbers up to 1000 when we are looking at addition questions.